Hi folks, I actually uh, wanted to let you know that, uh, you know uh, the place called, up in, that's up in like the Arctic, called Nuvut? Well, their price, their food prices skyrocketed. And you know, a, a thing of uh, two liters of like juice is like, almost 20 bucks and diapers I think about 20 or 30 bucks you know governments of the past have done things like this to force people off their land and you know that is exactly what the Canadian government is doing trying to starve the people to force them off their land so the government could move right in and drill for oil I'm sick and tired of this bullshit. You know, what the Canadian government is acting like is a fucking parasite. Yes, I'm swearing. It's because I'm pissed off at the government doing this. You know, folks, this type of food price increases is going to fucking spread all over Canada. I guarantee it. And you know, America's food prices are going to go up as well. Government's going to make growing your own food illegal. You know what's more, you know the populace is more easier to control if they're starving. And that is what the government is doing. Folks. This is bad. This is very, very bad what's happening. And you know, pardon my, pardon my pause, I'm just uh, very upset that the government would do something so fucking horrible. This is exactly what they do in dictatorships. <sighs> You know, folks, I'm sick and tired of the fucking government doing stuff like this. And, you know, I might as well just say, fuck the government. I'm now officially declaring myself a sovereign citizen. I don't want to even rely on the fucking government. <sighs> Folks, when will you wake up and realize what the government is doing to people is exactly what the fucking tires of the past have, do have done? Take communist China. They, like, the Food there is fucking high as fuck. Government is starving the populace so people would be more submissive. People are in China are not even allowed to really grow their own food. Government is trying to force people to take pharmaceutical garbage to have kill, harmed and killed more people while the natural herbal remedies that is found in nature that has been proven that it works is made illegal. Folks, wake the fuck up. Wake the fuck up and realize your government does not even give a fucking shit about you. And you know, Martial law is coming in Canada soon. I don't know when, I don't know what day, hour, year. I even talked to a soldier who just got back from deployment in Iraq. I asked him if the Canadian government is training the military for martial law. And you know what he said? He said that is exactly what they're doing. And I asked him, is he going to follow these illegal orders to detain and kill Canadian citizens? You know what he, I know what he said? He said, no. 
He's going to fight back against the government because he's got his own family. And under martial law, the government has to orders the soldiers to kill their own family. You know why? Because the family would be a distraction. And you know, in America, Obama, the dictator-in-chief, signed an executive order that will shut down the fucking internet. And the government will take control of public communications and private communications, which is illegal. Executive orders are illegal. Folks, what the governments are doing is a crime against humanity. I'm pissed off. I just want the government to fuck off and leave people alone and stop trampling on the rights of others and stop trying to force people to believe whatever the government tells them and orders them to say, think, and do. And I know the government is probably watching this video right now. You know what I say to the government and the federal agencies and big firma? Fuck off. Fuck off. And leave the fuck alone people alone. You fucking tyrannical parasitic government bastards are nothing but fucking parasites. That is exactly what you government bastards are. Leave people alone. Stop trying to control what we say, think, do, who we can and cannot worship, or what we can say, wear, whatever. Fuck off, government. Fuck off, Big Pharma. And I know the big... the government and the Big pharmaceutical companies and the mainstream media is lying to the public. I know it's they're lying to the people. They're saying that fluoride is healthy and all that crap. Bullshit. I got a fucking chemistry book that says that sodium fluoride is poison. Folks, go look up sodium fluoride in a chemistry book and you'll see what I'm talking about. It should not be in our water, food, whatever. It's poison. The government is deliberately poisoning and dumbing you down. This is why I don't trust the fucking government. I don't trust Big Pharma because Big Pharma meds that I used to be on were destroying my health. I almost died because of pharmaceutical garbage that by, made by Big Pharma. This is why I only use all natural stuff that comes from nature. I even smoke cannabis, a.k.a. marijuana, which is healthy. And the government makes it illegal because it cures, because they know it cures disease, and they'll put Big Pharma and the government out of business. Well, it wouldn't put the government out of business. It would just make government lose money, but it would put Big Pharma out of business because people would not be sick. Big Pharma was created to keep you sick and dependent on the government and Big Pharma to keep you alive. Big Pharma meds have killed and harmed more people while cannabis, aka marijuana, and all natural remedies have never killed anybody. Folks, don't trust the fucking government or Big Pharma or the mainstream media. They're fucking lying to you. And what they're doing in no the town of Nuvut raising the prices, so they're deliberately starving the people and trying to force them off the land so the fucking Canadian government can move in and drill for oil. That's all what it's about. Fucking oil and money. That's all it's about. Wake up, people. Wake up, Canada. Wake up, people of the world. Don't trust whatever the government and big pharma or the mainstream media tells you. They're fucking lying to you. Wake up, people. Wake the fuck up. And to the government, Big Pharma, that are watching this, and the other federal government agencies, this finger gesture is just for you. Fuck 
you. Fuck you and leave us the fuck alone.